this all up. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. So today I'm doing my Funko Pop collection video and I'm really excited to do this video because I have been collecting these Funko Pops for I think a little over a year now is when I really um, knew about Funkos and collecting them and all that. A lot of these were gifts to me, some I bought without money, some I got really discounted at stores, so yeah, it's just a bunch of different ways that I accumulated them. Also, just a little side note, I take my Funkos out of the boxes just so they can be displayed better because I personally am not super into just collecting and saving the Funkos for like value. I just like to do it because I love to just see my favorite characters in movies and TV shows and stuff and I'm not that into like preserving them if that makes sense. Over half of my Funkos are Star Wars but I'm gonna go ahead and do the ones that aren't Star Wars first. So, so I think this is the very first Funko that I even was gifted. Okay, Bailey got me the Ghostbuster Mott from Stranger Things, and he's my favorite character in Stranger Things. And we were at Target looking for this the other day, and they didn't have it. So the first Funko I have is Ghostbuster Mike from Stranger Things. So this is what he looks like. So this is the um, costume he wears in Season 2 when they go trick-or-treating. Mike is my favorite character from Stranger Things. And I was really happy when I got this. Um, I just love him so much. I love the detail, how it literally has his name tag of the Ghostbuster that he's supposed to be playing on him. And just everything about this. It's so cute and I love him so much. So this is the first one that I ever got. Next, I have Eric Killmonger. He is my favorite character from Black Panther. I love how he has his two weapons in his hand. He is a bobblehead and most, he's the only bobblehead I have that isn't Star Wars because all the Star Wars um, ones are bobbleheads. I love the detail in his outfit. I think there's, yeah, I think there's two of his pop figure. There's this outfit and then the one when he is um, in his Black Panther uh, suit fighting. I really like him. I love Michael B. Jordan in real life, so of course I love this character. Next, these are going in no particular order because those are the first two I got and then I can't remember after that point. So next, I'm wearing him on my shirt. I have Wreck-It Ralph and I love this Funko so much. He is so big compared to others. Like, here's Mike, here's Wreck-It Ralph. He's just really big and I think they meant to do that on purpose because he is a bigger character than most, but he literally is so cute. Wreck-It Ralph is one of my favorite Disney movies and I just love this Funko. So here's a little close-up of him. I absolutely love him, like, because I just love the movie and I love him as a character, so I'm really happy that I have him as a Funko in my collection. Alright, the next Funko that I have, and I love this one so much, I have Moana's grandma, and she is literally so beautiful. I love how she has the little flower in her hair, and just her outfit. She is just so, so beautiful. I love this so much. The song of the Ancestors is one of my favorite songs from the Moana soundtrack. And I just love her so much. So I'm really happy that I got this one. All right, the next Funko that I have is Dr. Shelley Oberin, 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 and I believe that's how it's pronounced. And he is from Jumanji 2, or Jumanji Welcome to the Jungle. And I love this character. If you don't know, Jack Black plays this character. And he's like, he plays the like teenage snobby girl when she gets into the video game and he was just hilarious in the movie so I had to get this Funko and he is just so funny I don't know I just love him from the movie okay so that is all of the non Star Wars Funkos I have the first Star Wars Funko I ever got 
was Kylo Ren with his mask on. And obviously Kylo Ren is like my favorite character of all time. So I was so happy to get this. And all the Star Wars Funkos come on this little stand and they are bobblehead. And then I also have Kylo Ren with his mask off. And I believe this is the um, Funko from the scene in The Force Awakens when he is outside fighting Rey. And he is trying to get her lightsaber out of the snow because as you can see he is standing on snow. And he's got his beautiful hair. <laughs> okay, so I have one last dark side Funko, and that is this one. This one is in the box because I just got this one the other day and I haven't took him out yet. But this is the Praetorian Guard, and this is one of my all time favorite scenes of Star Wars in The Last Jedi when they are fighting. Um, but as you can see, that's kind of what he looks like in the box. I'm not going to take him out because I have to film a video with him later. Alright, now I have a Funko from Rogue One. So I have K2SO. And if you don't know, this um, figure, he's basically like the C3PO of Rogue One. Um, he's like super hilarious and funny in the movie. He's one of the reasons I love Rogue One so much. So that is a little close-up of him. So yeah, I really love this Funko. And I believe I got him at an outlet mall and he was pretty cheap, so. And the last three are from um, Solo. Obviously I have to have Han Solo from Solo. So this is him. And I personally loved the actor who played him in the movie. I think he did an amazing job and I love this Funko. It looks really similar to him, honestly. And then to go along with Han, I have Akira. And obviously if you watch the movie, you know this is Han's love interest in the movie. I love her hair. Like the way the ponytail looks is so beautiful. And her outfit and her little stance is so, so dope. I love it. So yeah, that's her. I love her. The next one and the last one are actually one of my favorite characters from Solo. And it is Lando. And if you've watched the movie, you also know that he is played by Donald Glover, which is one of my favorite actors, musicians. He's so awesome. And yes, I just love his outfit, his little yellow shirt and everything, and his little ring detail. Like, it's just so, so awesome. So, that's him. So that is all of my Funkos. Obviously, I'll probably get more in the future, but that is it as of right now. I'm really happy with them. Okay, so I lied, and that wasn't actually the last one. This is the last one, but it's not a normal Funko. Alright, so I have a mini Funko Pop keychain of Spider-Woman and she is so cute. She's a little beat up because she is on my keychain, but that's what she looks like. I love this movie, Spider-Man Into the Spider-Verse. So awesome. It's coming out on Netflix too if any of you guys didn't know. It comes on June 26th. But yeah, so that is all my Funkos. I hope you guys enjoyed. I had a really fun time showing you guys all of them. Let me know down in the comments if you have any and which one is your favorite that you have or which one is your favorite that I have. And yeah, we can have a little chat down there if any of y'all want to. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. And if you've never seen my face before, please subscribe down below to see when I make a new video. You can also hit the bell icon and it will send you a direct notification when I upload a video. I hope you guys are having an amazing day and I'll talk to you guys in my next video. Peace. Shake it, shake it.